Hello, this is NixComputerFix.com and here's a video on the new Chromecast unboxing, setup, and review of the new black disk version. Okay, let's go ahead and start by taking a 360 degree look at the box itself. The front cover says Chromecast, cast your favorite entertainment to the TV. Um, some of the popular apps and the Chromecast device itself. On the left side, it says HD video streaming, surround sound support, 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi, screen mirroring, and a list of devices that it does support. Okay, um, on the back, it says simple setup using an HDMI port on your TV. On the right-hand side, smarter remote. Just tap the cast button in your popular mobile apps to start casting to your TV and the cables that are included. On the right hand side it says cast over 200,000 movies and TV shows, some of the most popular apps and App Store and Google Play is where you would get your Chromecast um, app. Alright, um, the bottom cover shows serial number, barcode and some small print and the top cover shows nothing. Okay, um, that's it for a look at the box itself. Let's go ahead and open this up by pulling this little tape off the side and detaching the cardboard cover off the box itself. And let's pop the top off and then we can take a look inside here. And the first thing, of course, is the Chromecast circular black disc itself that has a HDMI cable permanently attached to it and it's magnetically attached on the other end and so it makes it convenient to store. Let's go ahead and take a look at what else is in the box. We have the AC charger and the USB cable that attaches to the Chromecast device. We have nothing else left in the box however we do have some directions on the inside cardboard cover of the case and we'll get to that in a few minutes. Let's take a look at the Chromecast device um, again here, a little bit closer look. Um, it has a short HDMI tail on it which is permanently attached and on the back it does say HDMI and a lot of um, little fine print. Now the USB cable plugs into the Chromecast device and the other end plugs into the TV set and of course this plugs into your um, AC outlet on your wall. Alright, um, back to the directions on the inside cardboard cover. Number one, plug into power and TV. Number two, switch TV input. And three, set it up. So we're going to do that on the back of uh, my Vizio TV set. I have a 43 inch. You may have a larger one or a smaller one. Doesn't make any difference. Just go ahead and locate an HDMI port that's open. I'm going to uh, do the one on the side of mine which is available. Grab the HDMI cable on the Chromecast Make device. Make sure it's in there nice and snug. Once I've done that, I'm going to go ahead and grab the USB cable and plug it right into the Chromecast um, circular disk here and make sure I have it um, in the right you know, um, direction or position rather. Only fits one way and then go ahead and grab the other end of the cable which is the AC uh, charger and plug that into the AC outlet on my wall. Okay, next grab your TV remote and then locate your input button that will change the port on your television set where you have your Chromecast plugged into. Mine's plugged into HDMI 2 on the side and that's the one I've selected here. And once you do select it, you'll go ahead and get set me up and you'll get this URL address chromecast.com slash setup and of course if you grab your smartphone or your tablet and go to that address which is again chromecast um, let me move it over chromecast slash setup.com and once you're there it points you to downloading the app in my case it's the Google Play Store and I'm going to go ahead and select Play Store on my tablet here. 
And once I have, it'll come up and say Chromecast install the app. And of course, I'm going to go ahead and do that. And I'll accept that. And depending on the speed of your Wi-Fi, it can take a, a few seconds to, you know, a few minutes to download. At any rate, once it's finished downloading, you can go ahead and open it once it's in well it's going to install after it downloads of course and once it does install on your uh, mobile device you can go ahead and click on open and that'll open up the Chromecast um, app for you and the first thing that it says is cancel or accept obviously I'm going to say accept and from this point on I can go ahead and allow it to scan for Chromecast on my Wi-Fi network and hopefully it's going to find the Chromecast that I just plugged into my Vizio television set on HDMI 2 and it did Chromecast number 4085 needs set up and um, if I go ahead and you know touch okay hang on my finger is a uh, okay there we go I didn't touch it hard enough at any rate um, it'll come back and say let's set up Chromecast 4085 you'll be casting your favorite stuff in no time and if I click on or touch setup um, it's connecting to Chromecast 4085 and do I see the code on my television set S4 S2 and if I look on my TV set yes I do see it so I'm going to say I see the code and I'm going to go ahead and touch that and I need to learn how to touch it a little bit harder. At any rate, um, send Chromecast usage data and crash reports to Google. Set name. I can go ahead and set the name here, but I'm not. I'm going to use the default name, Chromecast 4085. And now it's going to ask me to go ahead and connect up to my um, Wi-Fi network. And I'm going to do that and be right back. Okay, I'm back. We're online. I've connected the Chromecast to my Wi-Fi network and it's going out and fetching updates that it needs to properly work. And while it's doing that, it actually gives you a tutorial um, that you can watch and it shows you how to connect to the Wi-Fi network, open an app, um, pick a video, and um, press the cast button to watch it on TV using your mobile device and as you can tell from this tutorial the response time from your remote is relatively fast um, considering um, for $35 um, it works very well and um, at any rate um, once it's finished fetching the updates and you're finished watching the tutorial um, it does need to reboot to apply the updates so it'll shut down and come back and then install the updates now depending on how many updates it went out and grabbed um, it can take a few minutes for it to complete its update and once it's completed you are ready to cast open the cast enable app and tap the cast button it's that simple okay um, that's it for this tutorial and I hope that this helps you set up your Chrome device when you get it. Subscribe and like my video.